Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Brothers and sisters, I'm sorry to bring this information to you on such a day. In Medina, there was a bombing. And this bombing occurred where basically no reported injuries as of yet, but I saw the video. It's approximately five to six cars on fire. It's hard to say, but yet it's a bombing in Medina near the Prophet's Mosque. This was reported by Russian Television's news and a couple of other sources. You can also see the video on Twitter. Now let's make a couple of things clear. People who are conducting such actions and atrocities near the Prophet Mosque are not Muslim. I don't care who you are or who, what group you claim you are, you are not Muslim. And as you can see, this terrorist, I guess you might call it uh, oligarch in Islam, well, under the name of Islam, these people are not Muslim. And this is becoming more and more apparent in the month of Ramadan. Now, what we must understand is that news that is reported, that is ap actually happening to us, is not news. It's actually false information used to propel false ideologies such as Islamic extremism, such as Islamist, these created terms to degrade the quality of our faith. Now let's understand one thing. Now since we know the truth that terrorist actions occur, such as the one in Medina who were done by non-Muslims, obviously a non-Muslim would do this, or kafir, then we should understand that other bombings should be questioned. And from this point forward, look at things with a very careful eye. And remember, the pressures of xenophobia we don't fall into the language. We stand firm on truth, brothers and sisters. This is your brother Umar reporting. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu.